Muscle Tov. Yo people, here is once more the Tsar and today I have a Oyster Stout. Well, Oyster Beer. <laughs> I don't really have experience in that. And you could ask who in this world puts an oyster into a beer? And that's a good question because <laughs> I don't know. But the ingredients are water, ale malt. Here is an English description and text on it. But the ingredients are just in English. I don't get it, but okay. Barley malt in flakes, roasted malt, roasted barley malt. So what is the roasted malt if it's not barley? <laughs> They don't say it here. Hop, Galena Nugget, East Kent Goldings and yeast. It's brewed with oyster flesh, oyster meat. Best before the 1st June 2019. So that is today. Well, I shoot mostly in the night. So it's the 2nd of June 2019 right now. And there is a weird story, huh? Because I was today in Kaufland, that's a German supermarket, very big supermarkets, at least in German standards. I don't know what is there in the US or so. And my girlfriend went and said at the reception or information or how is it called, could we please get a discount here because it is almost after the best before date and then the information woman said I cannot sell this to you but it was yesterday so the best before date is the first June 19 and she had to explain it to her you can't sell it today because today is the first June and well she didn't give her the discount so I went to the information again and I asked why don't you give a discount for this tomorrow you have to throw it all away and you get nothing so you can give a little discount today because it cost 1 euro 79 so i paid 3 euro 58 for the two bottles and that's <laughs> if you buy oettinger that's a cheap german beer but a good one then you get nearly a whole case of beer so it's a little bit expensive but she didn't give me the discount and i went there brought the two bottles because I have bought two, one for my German channel and she said oh you bring it back to me that's good because I cannot sell it today anymore <laughs> and I said to her today is the first June 19 and she wanted to take the bottles but I pulled them away <laughs> and on this day there was a warning strike and this woman I think it was exactly this woman who said all 10 minutes through the speakers in the whole supermarket we have a warning strike today so if you have some problems today then we would like to apologize and every 10 minutes she said it live not repeated from a I don't know electronic device or so and I asked her why won't you give me a discount for this and she said because I'm too dumb and I said to her yeah that's what I believe I said it two times that's what I believe you are right <laughs> okay so I paid the whole price for this although tomorrow oh today it is already old well it says in America and in the English speaking countries best before so it's not bad after this date but in Germany you say it is minimum edible, it holds minimum to this date. So in Germany you have no guarantee or anything after this date. I don't know how it's in different countries but well I will try now some oyster stout. And what is written there? You put what in? This stout is simply not suitable for vegetarians. It contains oysters. Now you won't find one at the bottom of the glass, but you may get a touch of sweet minerality. Minerality? 
in the flavor that comes from the freshly shucked lads that get put in during brewing. Not a bad way to go, even for a B-valve. Delicate and toastly, it also has slightly bitter fragrant twist, thanks to East Kent Goldings. So, it has a curl back tap, that's very nice, I like them. But they sprinkle a lot. Oh shit, what is this? <laughs> Woo. That was very sudden. So now... What did I smell right now? I will not tell you. Until I showed you the color of it. And the color is pretty much Coca-Cola. But with a foam crown. Pretty delicate foam crown. A bit like Guinness. Guinness is even finer. And there you see. It's as dark as Coca-Cola or coffee. Very dark. I don't even get through with my flashlight here. <sighs> Smells very roasted, very dark. No oyster smell at all. No sea flavors or anything. No sushi aroma at all. Just dark roasted barley. And maybe some hops. Yeah, hops. Yeah, but almost no green aroma. It is rather like tropical fruits. So it's a very fruity hops. I like shellfish. I just never tested it in beer. Muscle tough. Oh, whew. it's very bitter. I don't taste no oyster at all. It's just very bitter. And it has very much roasted aromas. It tastes like a very dark roasted malt. Yeah. I find it very good. Not bad. It has not very much aroma. But it's pretty bitter. But that's not bad. I like it. I don't taste no oyster at all. Minerally flavor. I don't even get why this is a craft beer. Because it has nothing special about it. It's just very roasty. Very dark. And very bitter. But that's pretty normal for a stout. So here or here other videos from me. I give it 7 out of 11 points. <laughs> that's a Sa Scala. Sa scale. <sighs> and ah. You don't have to give me a thumbs up. It would be too much work for you. I know. Bye people. Let's get my ins bed. Gute Nacht.